I moved to Timor Leste in the middle of 2012 to implement the, a large-scale randomized control trial that focused on control of soil transmitted helminths. These diseases are diseases typical of poor countries and, and poor settings because they are transmitted through the accidental ingestion of soil contaminated with feces that contains eggs of these worms or through penetration of the skin of some of the, their larvae. So historically, the World Health Organization advocates and is uh, involved in scaling up regular administration of deworming pills mainly to school-age children. But more recently, there are some suggestions that distribution of these deworming pills should be expanded to the entire community uh, so that it can have an effect on transmission of the parasites. Deworming campaigns should be uh, integrated with changes in the environment. So there's also interest in promoting WASH interventions, and that stands for water, sanitation and hygiene. And if our studies show that, yes, there's bigger and greater benefits. We can give this information to the WHO and to policymakers and say, okay, it may be more difficult to implement interventions at the community level than it is at the school level, but the benefits for children are bigger.